when join the totality of women and progressive men in Ghana in expressing our shock, disbelief, and revulsion at comments made by our president at the event. Ladies and gentlemen, the extent of national and international embarrassment we now face as a nation is magnified not only because our president is supposed to be an award-winning gender activist, but it's also made all the more alarming by the fact that the Women Deliver 2019 International Gender Conference is the largest conference on gender equality, the health, rights, and well-being of girls and women in the 21st century. It is nothing short of monumental disgrace to find that as the rest of the world and its leaders are tapping into and celebrating more gender inclusiveness, our president, Nana Adodankwa Akufu Adu, is referring, is reinforcing stereotypes regarding women's participation in leadership that have been long, that have long been abandoned. That global platform would have been a glorious opportunity to project the great exploits and strength of the Ghanaian women's unique social, culture, corporate, and political leadership skills. We would have hoped that at best, it would have been a tremendous opportunity for President Kufuado to showcase the contributions of successive governments in appointing capable women to positions of leadership and responsibility in this country's history. Indeed, a worst case scenario would have been to highlight his own efforts and his administration to enhance women empowerment in Ghana. It is pathetic to see that all President Akufuado could do was to feign ignorance about the implicit role required by men to create opportunities without apology for capable Ghanaian women and close the massive gender gaps that are doing nothing to move development in this country forward. Having been given a major opportunity on a global stage to project the great exploits and strength of the Ghanaian woman and to further elaborate on what measures his administration is adopting to enhance women empowerment in Ghana, President Kufuado did not hesitate to run down the Ghanaian woman in the most debasing manner on a global stage.